Hello, my name is Peter Franz and uh, we work here in South Sudan, including in the northern part of Kenya and in other parts wherever God sends us. But right at this very t moment in time, we are focused uh, in the eastern Equatoria area. We have set up a station here and have been um, trying to get established in places where people have never heard the gospel before. So right now uh, we are on a survey. We've been going through all through uh, South Sudan, especially in this area of Eastern Equatoria, a little bit into Buma and have been trying to get data and find out how unreached are these people. One thing that we really have encountered is the people struggle with poverty. They struggle with having lack of water and most of all reason for life. And I, I believe that is what the gospel can give them. Knowing Jesus is what makes the difference. And as people get to uh, be discipled and follow him, things change. We've, we have some beautiful examples. We have one young lady called Janet that was out of a, a village way deep in GA country where they've never heard about Jesus. And she, uh, as, as our uh, team went there, they uh, were able to, uh, to get her to go. Um, and she has gone to Kaptagat, to one of our uh, places where they can learn uh, discipleship making and she has her, heard the gospel and she has now she's ready to carry it back into her place which is just amazing so she'll be going back in the next few weeks and we look forward to that she's graduating now and she'll she'll be able to carry the wonderful gospel of the Lord into her own village that where she actually resides and this is going to be wonderful and it's going to spread out as we've seen here among the toposas the gospel has just spread out within four years we have over a hundred different fellowships and they're meeting and they're serious with god and they really want to grow in christ and they are growing and it's wonderful to see the transformation that this has brought already to, to the toposa community and it will do the same to the GA. As we've been going through the GA, we've seen a lot of water problems. People are lacking water. It is really, really hard. And so our prayer is that we can not only help them with, uh, bring the gospel to them, but we also would like to see that they get some development that can help them. And uh, if they would have that together with their little church that they have in the evening, they meet around the fire, there are no permanent buildings here then uh, this would really cause them to have a huge raise in their life standard. And we thank God for that. And I believe it's God's will that these people are reached. Thank you for standing with us. We are really on fire. We want to see these people be reached with the gospel, and we, but we need your support. Thank you for standing and, and also financially helping us to do what we need to do. God bless you so much.